Stripe Payment Tutorial – How to Use Stripe for Beginners Hi guys, this is Speak About Digital, and welcome to this video tutorial on how to use Stripe. Stripe is a renowned payment service provider that enables merchants to seamlessly accept credit and debit cards, as well as other forms of payment. It is an ideal platform for businesses that predominantly operate online, as Stripe offers a wide range of unique features specifically designed to enhance online sales. We have a lot to cover in this video, so let's get started with the tutorial. To begin using Stripe, the first step is to create an account. Visit the official Stripe website and locate the Start Now button on the home page. Click on this button to proceed with the account creation process. You will then be directed to another page where you'll be prompted to provide some necessary information. On the account creation page, enter your email address and full name. Additionally, choose your country from the available options and select a strong password for your account. Once you have filled in these details, click on the Create Account button to proceed further. After creating your account, it is essential to verify your email address. This verification step ensures the security of your account and enables you to access all of the features of Stripe. To verify your email, check your inbox for an email sent to you by Stripe. Open the email and click on the Verify Email Address button within the email to complete the verification process. Once you have successfully verified your email address, you will be automatically redirected to your account dashboard. From there, you can begin utilizing the various features and functionalities offered by Stripe for your payment processing needs. Once you access the dashboard, you'll notice that it is designed to be user-friendly and easy to navigate. The dashboard features a top menu that we would like to provide an overview of before moving on. These tabs include Home, Payments, Balance, Customers, Products, Billing, Reports, Connect, and more. The Home tab serves as the central hub where you can activate your payments. This tab presents an overview of your total sales for the current day, allowing you to quickly access your performance. Additionally, it displays the sales figures for the past seven days, enabling you to track your progress over time. You also have the flexibility to filter the sales data based on different time frames, such as the last seven days, four weeks, 12 months, and more. Under the Payments tab, you'll find a comprehensive overview of all of your payments. This section provides valuable insights into your payment activities, including a breakdown of transactions, disputes, and other relevant information. Moreover, this tab offers fraud and risk analytics, equipping you with tools to monitor and mitigate potential payment-related issues. Additionally, the Payments tab provides you with the option to generate payment links, allowing you to sell products, offer subscriptions, or accept donations with a simple and shareable link. The Balance tab in the Stripe dashboard provides you with a comprehensive overview of your account balance, including details of top-ups and payouts. Additionally, this section allows you to add your bank account, providing a seamless way to manage your funds and transactions. Under the Customers tab, you can easily add and manage your customer information. To add a new customer, simply click on the plus Add Customer button, and the necessary fields will appear for you to fill in the relevant details. Once you have added customers, their information will be displayed in an organized manner within this section, making it convenient to access and update customer records as needed. In the Products tab, you can define and manage the products you offer to your customers. To add a new product, click on the plus Add a Product button, and a form will appear where you can input the necessary details. Products encompass a wide range of offerings, including physical goods, digital services, and subscription plans. Once added, your products will be listed here, facilitating easy management and monitoring. The Billing tab provides you with a comprehensive overview of your billing-related activities. This section offers insights into invoices, subscriptions, quotes, and other relevant billing information. You can track and manage your billing operations effectively, ensuring smooth and efficient invoicing processes. Under the Reports tab, you'll find various types of reports to help you analyze your financial performance and gain valuable insights. Financial reports include balance, payout reconciliation, and revenue recognition, which assist in assessing your financial health. Additionally, analytics reports, such as billing analytics, radar analytics, and payment authentication, provide you with data-driven insights to optimize your payment processes and enhance overall performance. Stripe Connect, accessible through the Connect tab, offers a fast and convenient way to integrate payments into your platform or marketplace. This feature enables seamless transactions and facilitates payment processing for your users or customers. 
In addition to these tabs, on the top right side of the dashboard you'll find additional options and functionalities. These include the ability to create invoices, subscriptions, and payment links. There is also a Help button, allowing you to access support when needed. The Notification button keeps you informed about important updates and activities related to your Stripe account. Finally, you can access the Settings and Account sections, providing you with control over your account preferences and configurations. Now, let's see how to activate your Stripe account. To activate your Stripe account and start accepting real payments, follow these steps. Initially, you can begin using your account in test mode to simulate Stripe's features without involving real money. However, to accept genuine payments, you must activate your account and switch to live mode. To activate your payments, navigate to the Home tab on the dashboard and click on it. Within the Home tab, locate and click on the Activate Payments button. This action will redirect you to another window where you'll be required to provide some basic information about your business. Next, you'll need to verify your personal details. Stripe collects this information to ensure the security of your account and verify your identity. Enter your name, email address, date of birth, home address, phone number, and social security number as requested. Once you've filled in this information, click on Continue to proceed to the next step. After verifying your personal details, you'll be prompted to provide information about your business. This data allows Stripe to better understand and serve your specific business needs. Choose the appropriate industry category that best represents your business. Enter your business website URL and provide a brief description of the products or services you offer. Once you've provided this information, click on Continue. The next step involves describing how you fulfill orders and your business operations. This information helps Stripe ensure compliance with relevant regulations and guidelines. Specify the time period in which your customers typically receive their goods or services after making a payment. Once you've made the appropriate selection, click on Continue to proceed. The next step is to add public details for your customers. This information may appear on payment statements, invoices, and receipts. Fill in the necessary details, ensuring accuracy, and click on Continue to proceed. After adding public details, it's time to link your bank account to your Stripe account for seamless payouts. Payouts refer to the transfer of funds from Stripe to your designated bank account. By adding your bank account information, you enable the smooth receipt of payouts and help Stripe gain a better understanding of your business. Once you have entered the required bank account details, click on Continue to move forward. To maintain the security of your Stripe account, you have the option to use additional authentication measures. By setting up either your phone or an authenticator app alongside your password, you can ensure that no unauthorized access occurs. You can choose to use an authenticator app or a security key or receive verification codes via SMS. Select your preferred option and click on Continue to proceed. The next step involves automating sales tax calculation, although this section is optional and can be skipped if desired. Stripe Tax offers tools to help you monitor your tax obligations, automatically collect the correct amount of tax, and seamlessly file tax returns. If you choose to utilize this feature, select your product category and click on Continue. The final step is to review all the information you have provided. Take a moment to thoroughly review the details to ensure accuracy. Once you are satisfied and confident that everything is in order, click on Agree and Submit to complete the process. After successfully activating your account and completing these steps, you will be able to immediately start accepting live payments. Your Stripe account is now fully functional, equipped with the necessary information and security measures to facilitate smooth and secure transactions. Next, let's see how to create a payment in Stripe. To create a payment using Stripe, follow these steps. Start by navigating to the Payments tab on the dashboard and click on it. This action will direct you to the Payments page where you can manage your payments activities. On this page, locate and click on the Create a Payment button to proceed. After clicking on the Create a Payment button, you will be taken to another page specifically designed for payment creation. On this page, enter the desired amount for the payment in the designated field. Additionally, select the currency for the transaction with the US dollars being the default option. Proceed to the next step after entering the amount and currency. At this point, you have the option to enter customer information, although this step is optional. If applicable, you can enter relevant details about the customer associated with the payment. This can include their name, contact information, or any other relevant identifiers. If you choose to skip this step, you can move on to the next phase of payment creation. Next, provide a description of the product or service associated with the payment. 
This description helps provide clarity and context for the payment transaction, aiding in record keeping and customer understanding. Finally, you need to enter the card information associated with the payment. This includes the card number, expiration date, and CVC, card verification code. Ensure that you enter these details accurately to facilitate a successful transaction. Once you have filled in the necessary card information, navigate to the top right corner of the page and click on the Submit Payment button to complete the process. By following these steps, you can easily create a payment using Stripe. Whether you are receiving payments for products, services, or any other transactions, Stripe's intuitive interface and secure payment processing system enables smooth and efficient payment management. Now, the next thing to learn is how to create a new invoice in Stripe. So, to create a new invoice using Stripe, follow these steps. Start by navigating to the Payments tab on the dashboard and click on it. This action will take you to the Payments page, where you can manage your payment activities. On this page, locate and click on the Create button, positioned at the top right side of the screen. After clicking on the Create button, you will be presented with four options. Invoice, Subscription, Payment Link, and Manual Payment. Since your goal is to create a new invoice, Click on the first option, which is Invoice. Upon selecting this option, you will be redirected to another page where you can input the necessary information for the invoice. Firstly, add a customer to the invoice. Enter the name or email of the customer in the Customer field. By adding a customer, you can save their payment methods and keep track of multiple charges associated with them. Once you have added the customer, proceed to add items to the invoice. These items can represent the products or services for which you are generating the invoice. Include the details of each item, such as the name, description, quantity, and price. Next, you need to choose the payment collection method for the invoice. You can select between the request payment and auto charge customer options, depending on your preference and the specific payment arrangement with the customer. After selecting the payment collection method, you have the option to include additional details on the invoice such as a memo, footer, custom fields, and a tax ID. Tick the radio button next to each option to choose the desired additional information for the invoice. Once you have provided all the necessary information for the invoice, click on Review Invoice to review and verify its details before publishing. Take a moment to ensure that all the information is accurate and complete. By following these steps, you can easily create a new invoice using Stripe. This feature enables you to efficiently generate professional invoices for your customers and streamline your billing processes. Next, how to add a product in Stripe. To add a product in Stripe, follow these steps. Start by navigating to the Products tab on the dashboard and click on it. This action will take you to the Products page, where you can manage your product listings. On this page, locate the Plus Add a Product button and click on it. This will open a new window where you can enter information about your product. Begin by entering the name of your product in the designated field. This is a required field and helps identify your product within Stripe. You can add a description for your product, but it is optional. This description will be displayed at checkout on the customer portal and in quotes, providing additional details about the product to your customers. You also have the option to add an image of your product. This image will appear at checkout and can help customers visualize the product they are purchasing. Make sure to use a JPEG or a PNG file that is smaller than 2 megabytes. If you click on additional options, you will see several optional settings. One such setting is the statement descriptor. This allows you to override your account descriptor for payments made through subscriptions. You can enter a statement descriptor that your customers would recognize on their bank statements. Additionally, you can enter a unit label for your product. This describes how you sell your product, such as charging per seat per item. The unit label will appear at checkout as well as in invoices, receipts, and the customer portal. To save a product, you must add at least one price. Scroll down to the price information section and choose a pricing model from the drop-down menu. Enter the price for your product. You can also change the currency if needed. The default currency is US dollars. Choose the billing period for the price, such as one time, weekly, monthly, or annually. You can create multiple prices for a single product if necessary. Once you have entered all the required and optional information for your product, click on Save Product button at the top right corner of the page to save the product. After adding a product, you can find it in the Products section. By clicking on the Products tab, you will see a list of all the products you have added to Stripe. This allows you to manage and edit your products as needed. By following these steps, you can easily add a product to your Stripe account. This feature enables you to effectively organize and manage your product catalog, facilitating smooth transactions and a seamless customer experience.
And there you have it, a beginner's guide to using Stripe. You can sign up using the first link in the description. I appreciate that, thank you. We hope you found this video informative and gained a better understanding of the various features and functionalities that Stripe has to offer. With Stripe, you can easily accept different types of payments online and make your customers buying experience smooth and secure. By using Stripe, you can grow your business and improve your online transactions. So again, if you found this video helpful, please give me a thumbs up, and if you have any questions at all, please comment below. I try to answer all the comments the best I can.